Thanks, Jeff. It is always so good to hear from Jack Tretton. I'm glad you had a chance to grab him. He's a very, very busy man. Now joining us is Anon Argwal. Did I say that right? Yes. Yes, I got it wrong the first time. Yeah. <laughs> he is from Sony Computer Entertainment, and he has with him the new Pulse Wireless Stereo Headset Elite Edition. So tell us all about the new features of this headset um, over the past edition. Sure. Let me start with showing what this headset looks like. Um, this headset, so last year we released the wireless stereo headset for PlayStation 3, and it's a really popular product. And this headset is the latest new premium version of the same headset. So what we're calling it is the Pulse Wireless Stereo Headset Elite Edition. And it has some really cool features. So I'm going to walk you guys through what those features are. Great. So first of all, it has all the great features that our earlier headset had. So it has virtual surround sound. Um, it has great voice communication. Mm -hmm. um, it works with PS3 seamlessly. So all the updates and everything you'll see on the headset screen. Um, but we are, we have included some really great features. So the first thing that I want to talk about is uh, what we are calling the base impact technology. Now I read a little about this. There's something about a whole bunch of little pulses. Tell me more about these little pulses. Sure. So this is a Sony proprietary technology. Uh, and what it does is it takes low frequency bass sounds and uh, turns them into pulses that uh, gamers are going to feel around the earbuds of, wow. uh, of the headset. So it's going to just take immersion to the next level because you're not only feeling the rumbles on the controller, you're hearing pulses that are really in sync with the game sound very on the cool. headset. So uh, we are very excited about this feature. Um, it's called Bass Impact Technology. That's awesome. Now, how many preset modes does the headset feature? So, uh, great question. Uh, the next feature is the preset modes. And what we did was uh, took this base impact technology and tweaked it to not only offer immersion, but also uh, competitive advantage. Okay. So, these preset modes are tailored to different gaming genres. So, to, uh, to answer a question, there would be preset modes for, say, the shooting genre, the racing okay. genre, the fighting genre. Uh, there'll be a preset mode for just music and for movies. Cool. Because on PlayStation 3, you can use this headset not only for gaming, but also for listening to music or uh, like when you're watching movies. On That's the PlayStation awesome. 3 so when that. I get my new Sound Shapes game, I can use that and get it all right in my ears, my PS3. That's great. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, definitely. Now, I've heard that this has a noise-canceling microphone as well. Yeah. So uh, one thing you would notice about this headset is that it does not have a boom microphone, yeah. like typical gaming headset. Right, a little like Call of Duty, like yeah. little microphone, yeah. And, and, <laughs> and really, the reason is because um, we really wanted to come up with a streamlined design, and we really want consumers to use it not only in their home with PlayStation 3s, but also with their PlayStation Vitas and uh, with their mobile phones, their MP3 players nice. and whatnot. So this headset has an audio jack right here, okay. um, and we'll uh, pack in an audio cable using which you could connect it with your Vita or your mobile phone or your MP3 player. And we really want consumers to not only use it within their home with PS3, but take it outside, use it with their portable devices and whatnot. Very and cool. um, and the hidden microphone, you know, it's, uh, it's still great voice communication. Uh, that's, again, our nice Queensland technology that enables that. That's awesome. OK, now I know everyone wants to know, ship date, price point. Big questions. Do we know <laughs> that yet? Yes. So ship dates. Um, Consumers will find it in the store early October, cool. and price points, it's a great price point of $149.99. Wow, that's great news. Well, thank you, Anand, so much for stopping by and sharing your new toy with us. We really thank appreciate you so it. Much. Thanks for the opportunity. All right, guys. Well, I'm sorry, but we are almost out of time here on Mornings with Meredith. You have to stay tuned, though. Ray Gutierrez is talking with some of the guys from The Last of Us. That trailer last night was insane. They lit a dude on fire. I couldn't believe it. And then we are going to have a very jam-packed schedule for the rest of today. Um, we've got uh, God of War Ascension coming up later today. We've got um, Little Big Planet 2 for Vita coming up later today. Um, there's going to be uh, Assassin's Creed Liberation, which I believe is at around 3 o'clock. So, so much good stuff. You don't want to stop that stream. And remember, if you miss any of the incredible footage from today's live coverage, you can check out the Pulse Highlight Day 1 show at the end of the day for anything you missed with the beautiful Christina Lee. I want to thank all my guests, including David Cage, for stopping by. This has been Mornings with Meredith. I'm Meredith Malnari, and I'll see you all tomorrow at 10 a.m. Enjoy the rest of our broadcast.